Welcome ladies and gentlemen, my name is Jacob and this video is a little bit of a breaking news within the North American Gears of War competitive community. Uh, as you can see by the video already, United has made a roster change and it was to me a little bit surpri surprising since at London they beat Envy or they beat Optic in their very first series. And then, you know, they lost two straight. They went to this Vegas thing. They played them, had a little bit of issues, but they played Optic really well. And they've been playing really, really, you know, well since picking up Clouds. And I've seen progress, and then they're just getting better and better. And then they make a roster change. And it just, to me, I can see this team sticking together for a long time. So I'm kind of surprised by the roster change itself. For those of you who don't know, uh, United actually dropped Clouts and Kyle from the roster. And that just surprised me so much since the throwdown days, you know what I mean? They have so much chemistry, they have a skill with each other, they work well with each other, but they, you know, were dropped. And a lot of you people are out there are wondering, for who, for who, for who? And this is not official yet. It's not 100% official until these guys tweet it out themselves in the org and they get their contracts or whatever it is with the United. This is not official, but this is what the roster is going to be. They're going to add Excels and Soto to that mix. I said that again. Let me say it one more time. Excels and Soto. To me, that that roster on paper is disgusting when it comes to like skill and everything. It's just you know the variable with every team out there is going to be how well they work with each other. How you know the callouts, how they can take constru constructive criticism with one another. But I know Demo and Excels have teamed together in the past. Excels and Soto, obviously. I know Dispensa might have played with Excels in the past. Um, I know Excel was, was part of that wager squad with them, and as for Soto, Soto's proven time and time again with Envy, with the Glory Squad, Echo Fox. Now he's gonna has a chance to do it here again. He is a force to be reckoned with. People see him as an inconsistent weak link. But his results say otherwise. His results say otherwise. So that's gonna bring us to a little bit of something else here. You know, Kyle's the one who tweeted it out, and here you go, as you see it here. As some of you may know, Clouts and I were dropped from a United. Not going to say much about it. Good luck to them. So good sport from Kyle right there. And we're going to go with what Demo had to say as well. Kyle and Rod are all great players. We feel like we needed a change to better round out our team. Got so much love for them regardless. So it's actually, I I I kind of like the attitude from it. I I can see where demos coming from with the better you know to round out their squad. You know what I mean? They had a couple events to beat Optic. I know that, and like I said, I don't think they should have made a roster change, but I think this is a really great roster change for them. It, it's so good to me on paper. It's just it game time. They just lost a 250 series to Echo Fox. So it's, the players, they dropped. They lost a series, a 250 series to them. Um, but we're going to go over to Frank. Frank from Echo Fox. I know he bounced around the rosters. This is one of my favorite people right here. Frank, people more concerned about the team change than we are. It's business, simply. So even Frank, you know, from the Soto Excel side of things, he's not taking it to heart. And I'm pretty sure they're really excited um, for... You know the future to come so so what they have in store for them this new echo fox squad they already beat united uh that roster itself either isn't official but it was frank kyle clouts speedy and i really forgot about his name already i'm sorry guy but i really think they have what it takes Echo Fox and this United roster. I want to see them play on LAN already. I already want to see how they're going to play on LAN and how they're going to just perform from here on out for the for the rest of the season because I really don't want any more roster changes from, from any of these top teams that are neck and neck with each other. It's not coming down to who's more mechanically skilled or anything like that. It's coming down to who shows up to play on game day and Optic is the only team consistently able to show up. Like I said, they, they lost in Columbus to NBA a series in the Grand Finals. They lost to United in the Winter Finals, come back and won two series in the Grand Finals. But I mean, it is what it is. United's new roster rumors of their new roster excels soto dispensa demo and icy so be on the lookout for that roster if everything is official 
and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys have anything you want to add, any questions, anything, please be sure to post in the comments below. Make sure you give the video a like, tweet it out, share it, and you know, just enjoy it. Thank you guys for coming out to another Gears of War breaking news segment with another roster change. You guys have a great night. Peace.